The color scheme in Microsoft PowerPoint can sometimes impact things in ways that might surprise you. For example, let's say I'm typing something here and I want to add in either a web address or an email address. So I type in www.mcstech.net and I press enter and notice how it automatically changes the color of the font. It gets even worse if I click on it to actually activate that link, then it will change to a different color. If you're wondering how you can manage this so that it doesn't automatically change those colors, what you need to do is go to the Design tab and look at your color scheme. So the color scheme lives on the Design tab. Over here on the right, you'll notice there's a Colors button. And if I click on the down arrow, I can go in here and create a new theme. Now, what happens down here, you notice at the bottom it has hyperlink colors and a followed hyperlink. If I don't want these colors to change when I create a hyperlink, what I can do is I can click on the drop down here and change that to the same color as my font. So I might change that to white. I also might change a followed hyperlink. If I actually really want to make it be consistent, I would change it to white. Maybe I would change it to a different, like a lighter shade of gray and then go ahead and press save. You'll notice now it looks the same as the other font. Um, and so it's still a hyperlink, but at least the font color doesn't change automatically.